Hey, what's up, guys? Riley Owen. Thought it'd be a really fun video to do my bootleg physical media collection. This is DVDs and Blu-rays. I don't have any homemade. These are all homemade, by the way. I shouldn't say bootleg because I do have bootlegs that I did not include because they're not homemade. These are DVDs and Blu-rays that I have made. Cool? You ready? Let's start. Let's start with the DVDs. Um, obviously didn't spend time on this artwork. This is Toon Disney Volume 1 has an episode of Schnookums and Meat, an episode of Nightmare Ned, and an episode of Bonkers. Here's the spine, and there's no back, and the DVD in the inside. Never made a volume two, just this is the only volume I made. Next, we got a similar DVD. Um, this is, it just says four TV shows in one. There's one episode of each of these shows. Episode of The Amanda Show, episode of Malcolm, episode of Drake and Josh, and episode of Zach and Cody. There we go. There's the inside, and then there is the episodes there. Pretty cool. Uh, this is Pokemon Indigo League. Uh, this is the last 26 episodes, because um, I have the Blu-ray set of the first season, and they cut out 26 episodes, so this has the remaining, um, plus the four band episodes and a bunch of other awesome extras. This is actually, oh man, this is a Blu-ray. It's in the DVD case, so I thought it was, uh, whatever. I'll show it anyway. Um, there's a front, spine, and the back. Three disc set. There is Gary on disc one. Disc two, Officer Jenny, and the last disc is the bonus disc. Obviously didn't spend much time on the artwork there either. I usually don't spend much time on the artwork. Here's Oz with Lucky Rabbit, Disney cartoons from 1927 to 1928. This was made during the time when uh, The Old Swimming Hole, Empty Socks, and, oh, what's the other one? Um, High Up were not uh, available to the public. Now, I like, uh, I, I don't like to brag about this, um, but I'm going to for a second because um, it's freaking awesome. Um, you know what, actually, I'm going to save that for a different video. If you guys want to hear about um, a story about how those three Oswald films got released to the public, I'm the one who pretty much made that happen. And I'll tell you that story if you guys want to hear it. But here's disc one and disc two. These were all the ones available at the time. I actually didn't upgrade for this. Uh, here's some Bosco cartoons. There's just four of them. The Boost Hangs High, Congo Jazz, Box Car Blues, and Battling Bosco. There you go. And there's actually a few more DVDs that I don't have. Um, I just have the discs. So I'll do a part two of this. Uh, Mr. Meaty. This is not the complete series. I was going to do a complete series set. Um, you can hear the dogs up there. Um, but I ended up just doing the uh, shorts. for Like, I just made disc one, which was just the shorts. And that's all that this is. Just the shorts of Mr. Meaty, kind of used as a pilot. It's a good show, I think. Swing Parade of 1946, the Three Stooges film. It's a really good movie. Multiple copies of that one. Uh, now we're going to go on to Blu-rays, which I have a lot more of. Um, here's The Amanda Show. It's season one of The Amanda Show. 13 episodes. There you go. Didn't spend much time on the artwork. And then I actually, um, I have season two on DVDs, so I made a matching season three. That sort of matches along with, uh, um, you know, the design. But there's there, 10 episodes. There you are. I usually don't do disc labels, so. Here we got Hour Gang Silence, or the Hour Gang Silence Shorts Collection, as I called it. You guys should know I'm a very big Hour Gang fan. There you go. There are these shorts on the back. This is uh, just a handful of Amanda Show episodes from seasons one and two. Nothing much. I'll show you the back of the disc since there's really nothing else to show. But, yeah. All that, season four, or the best of season four. 
So it was probably just all the season four episodes I could find. And I burned them to a disc. Pretty cool. Oh gosh, I'm trying to stack these up nicely and it's not working. SpongeBob! Four episodes, four of some of the hated episodes. The Splinter, which I like. Scooter and Claire Netland, which is not hated. About for Gary, which I like. Stuck in the Ringer, which I think is pretty bad. Don't ask me why I made this, because I really don't know. And yes, there's four episodes, and that's it. Here's what I was talking about. I did a remake of this DVD um, with the updated shorts, plus a bunch of other stuff. And, uh... I put 20 cartoons, or 26 cartoons, I meant to say 19. Here's some of the special features. It's pretty cool. There you go. Wonderful. Love Oswald. Guess House Kids Go West. That's when uh, Carl Schweitzer tried to bring back our gang uh, sort of thing. This is a good movie. Uh, this is a very dumb decision. Wasted a whole Blu-ray. Because I just wanted to be, um, well, maybe I won't talk about it. But I made this extremely crappy, on-purpose um, Oswald cartoons. This is an hour of crappy Oswald cartoons. Um, the cartoons aren't crappy, but the prints are. We got And Mother Makes 3, the complete series. I love this show. This is one of the uh, my favorite British shows, along with Mr. Bean and The IT Crowd, which The IT Crowd is my all-time favorite British show. Again, didn't really spend time on the artwork, but this is a great show. Wonderful. Pinocchio! I'm getting goofy now, but Pinocchio! Uh, this is a, uh, from a 35mm print of the film that I got from my good friend Steve Stanchfield. And, uh, yeah... Day the Clown Cried. I am a big Jerry Lewis fan. This is not the full movie, obviously. And this was actually before I got my hands on, uh, like, what, 30, 30 minutes? And it was, what, 29 minutes um, of, like, some Russian copy of the film, which I have now. I didn't have it at the time. So um, this is just, like, a documentary and a few other things. Pretty uh, sad that I, if I made this, like, a little bit longer uh, after I did, would have got the film on Blu-ray. Um, now we have the last uh, bunch, and these are all in a set. I wanted to make a box set of it, but I didn't. These are all Jerry Lewis films. Cinderfella. Visit to a Small Planet. That's my boy. Jumping Jacks. Who's minding this store? It's all only money. Rockabye Baby and the Caddy. These all match. And I took the painstakingly time, even though they're not all in the best quality. Um, some of these films didn't exist with this same sort of style. As you can see, like the style with the text and the character and the white background. This, for example, I had to make this cover and I had to make it look like the others. You can kind of tell. But, um, you know, I tried to make them all match. These are all pretty good films. Uh, I have not seen all of them. I'm a big Jerry Lewis fan, but I have not seen all his movies because he has so many. I have not seen Who's Minding the Store, which I'll put over here. I have seen Rockabye Baby. I have seen The Caddy. I haven't seen It's Only Money. I have seen Jumping Jacks. I haven't seen That's My Boy. I haven't seen Visit to a Small Planet, and I have seen Cinderfella, so those, uh, I'm gonna make a part two, because there, I remember there's some discs that don't have cases that I should bring out, so stay tuned for part two.